Welcome back to Factorio, folks. We are joined as always by ST Hedgehog. Hello. Hello, hello. And we have had some technical dif difficulties. Uh, yes. Yes. Um, Factorio does not like spaces in player names. No. <laughs> it really, really doesn't. So I am without any stuff because we just couldn't figure out how to to, to, to get my old player name with a space in it back. So I have nothing. So I am going to be making my, my stuff. But uh, you have been busy in uh, the 80-ish episode on, uh, on, on uh, your Yes, site. yeah, the one that's coming up. Uh, well, we're recording on Sunday today because of the issues. But yeah, um, mm. yeah, I've been busy. I, I, uh, I started playing about 10 o'clock yesterday and came off at half past six in the evening. Wow. Um, and it wasn't because I've done a lot off camera. Um, it's just that I wanted to line up all the rails and and move things around all in preparation for when we can build things. Yeah, sounds cool. I'm looking forward um, to seeing and, it. Uh, uh, yeah, well. Um, so, well, shall we, shall we, we'll, we'll start here, shall we? Um, yeah. Uh, remember, I'm, I'm a lot faster now. Uh, this, this is the iron smelting. Okay. Cool. Um, we've got three trains that come in. Mm -hmm. They will go up. They will go through the iron smelting uh, process as, as as normal up to your rails at the top, which I haven't done anything with. Okay. Uh, they're all still there. So, however you wanted to connect that up, that was your choice. Um, I did discover so that cool. you can put the trains in vertically rather than horizontally, and there's enough space. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So. Uh, See, so you can put a train every like middle one of these. The tracks line up perfectly well with the the central belts. Uh huh. Okay. So, uh, but cool. do whatever you want to. Uh, next door we got the copper, which is twice as big as the iron. Mm hmm. How, how many irons do we have? Uh, there are. I mean, there's four belts coming there. So there's four, eight, uh, twelve, four, eight, twelve, twelve. Oh. All right. At the moment. All right. That's perfect. And I did that because you've got three trains here. So yeah. Exactly. That's perfect. So that means yeah. that we have 24 copper. Uh, yeah, should be. Yep. Very nice. And there's a little gap in between each one, so it makes sure that the uh, trains line up. Yeah. So at every central point, you can put a station in if you want to, because down the bottom, mm. that's what I've done. Yeah, very cool. See, <laughs> all, all the trains do this, and the rubber ports are offset because I had no choice. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. they get in the way. The, the, Those rover they get in the way. Yeah, uh, but yeah, but we've got a, a new track going along the centre. Mm-hmm. Coming along. Um, cool. And, uh, and a lot yeah. of uh, storage chests. That's that's our central storage. All the storage chests are there, so that's everything we own. Okay. Is in those chests. Cool. Uh, <laughs> I think that should be enough. I keep finding random chests in places, so I just turn <laughs> off my personal rover port and just go remove and let it fit all the storage. So yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. So, uh, so that that's probably cool. mostly my chests, the, the random ones. Uh, maybe. Oh, uh, there is one thing I will point out. Uh, there is a chest here next to me that has repair ah, things okay. in it. So Very that's good. always putting repairs into that central rover port. Yeah. So. Uh, so Excellent. We've got repairs, and uh, that one there was just because I was trying to find the cars, and I couldn't find the cars. I've lost them. I don't know where they are. <laughs> okay. they're, they're apparently not in the system, so they might be in a wooden chest somewhere. I don't know. Okay. But I was hoping at some point I'd find them. But yeah. Yeah. If we come down here, uh, oh, that's a random stop just to get a train out of the way. Okay. And uh, okay. you'll see. Here we have something. Da, 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 da. Oh, we have nuclear power. The nuclear power plant. It's a slightly different design. Um, mm -hmm. The one that I originally based it off of, I found the blueprint string to it, so I just imported it and. Uh, okay. So to go that way, um, you can squeeze through. So you can actually get through. It is a bit weird on the old controls, but you can actually get through and walk through it if you want to, or just go round. Okay, I think uh, going round is probably easier, yeah. but it looks really good. It's uh, it's it's yeah, it's a, uh, it works really well. Mm, I like uh, it. And then obviously this down here is your bit pieces, but I had to slightly move something here. Yeah, no worries. Um, because the train track was 
literally one square out. Oh. So, as you see, I've had to move it over one. Yeah. yeah to yeah. Uh, connect it up that way. Doesn't matter. Uh, but yeah, that's that's about it, I think. Um, I don't think there's any other changes I've done yet. Wow. See, the old places come out. Uh, where the old stations were, I'm going to put in a steel. Okay. Works. Uh, yeah. Top, top right corner was going to be steel. Yeah. And uh, oh, you can see also I've got another place where I've got five trains just parked, waiting, doing nothing. Uh, where's that? Just underneath the iron. Ah, oh, there. Tops. Yeah. Yeah. That's where that's where all the trains just are. They're just there. Uh, okay. Perfect parked up um mm -hmm. but i've gone around and all the rover ports around the outside of the the place are all lined up properly okay so if you take your queue from the sides mm -hmm. that'll work fine okay uh, the only thing is at the top it's slightly off yeah because uh, it was the wrong side of things so yeah well so yeah that's uh that is very cool man that's you've what been, been up to you have been busy uh, my, most of my time was actually building that iron drop off. Uh, the amount mm -hmm. of times I put all the smelteries in, found out I didn't have enough space, and then removed them all and put them all back in again. <laughs> and th those robots have really, really done their jobs worth. Okay, that's good. That's good. And it looks really cool. I really like it. I'm afraid yeah. to come and mess it up now. That's okay. Oh, one thing I do want to do in the blueprints book, if I drop the robot port, oh, there you go. Uh, there's a robot port grid. Um, okay. In there. Uh, with four robot ports. And loads of power cables, yeah. Yeah. Um, but it, it doesn't completely fill the area with power cables, it leaves gaps in between so you can actually build. Okay. Very cool. Um, yeah, and that's what I've been using everywhere. Uh, yeah. I really should try and hunt where I actually got these blueprints from and put the links down below, but I will try and remember that if I can find them again. Yeah. I hope. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, yeah, that's what I want to. Uh, one other thing I discovered as well, there's an option in the settings where if you have something on your action bar that you don't actually own, mm -hmm. you can put down a ghost of it by default. Okay. Which has become unbelievably useful. Um, I can imagine. Uh, yeah, in uh, in your settings interface, uh, on the left-hand side, right at the bottom, it's got pick ghost items if none are available, or no items are available. Pick ghost items if... yeah. Confirm. And then if you've got... if you're, if you're missing something, you can still put down a ghost of it, and then the robots will go, hey, let's come and put that down. That is really when nice. Yeah, it's... it's, it's really useful especially when placing concrete because you end up using a hundred concrete really quick yeah you do you do all right very cool man you've been busy i uh, I've, I've been trying i've been trying um that is really well, nice really i suppose uh, uh where oh, that chest. Uh, where did we put that requested chest oh look, here here i put it here Oh, okay. I just went and picked it up automatically. Like, oh, what's that doing? <laughs> yeah, so, so yeah, if you just request stuff, the robots will fill that chest up with things and hopefully you can get back on your feet quicker. Yeah, sounds good. If anyone does know how we could recover a character or how you can add spaces to a name, that it'd be useful because then you could log in once, drop all your stuff in a chest and then... Very useful. But we can't do it. We've even tried going and editing files in Windows and just can't... Yeah. No dice. Computer says no. Computer says no. Yeah, it does. All right, so 60 processing units, 40 electric engines. Okay. Right, well, I suppose I shall try and get on making the steelworks. Uh, is that iron enough, do you reckon? I think so. I think yep. so. Right, because if I put the steel in, obviously it's going to use the space and we won't be able to expand anymore, so... No. But there's always space elsewhere, you know, we've... we've... Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll we've be got fine. the technology. We'll be fine. Okay. Mm. 30 low density structures. Maybe a lot more. So let's remove all them trees as well. Um, bum, 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 bum. 
So I need more electric engine units. And I need more of these guys. Let's set that up to. Let's see, 300. And then I needed no density structures, speed module twos, and efficiency module twos. Uh, right. So, so the train track has to be at this level, otherwise I don't have enough space. Speed module twos. Mm, I don't know what, let's just say 30 and I think it was, was it efficiency or was it, it was efficiency? Uh, uh, oh, I've, I've got some speed modules on me, I suppose I'll drop them off. Uh, I, I think uh, I'm getting everything I need. Yeah, you, you made loads of them, but I, I was a... Uh... Mining up the rest of the little copper load that was down there, and I threw speed modules and everything. Ah. And, and discovered that stack inserters are really good. <laughs> uh, yes, they are. They are. Right, so that's the Power Mark II being made. And I need some exoskeletons for that. I need steel plate. I don't need that anymore. Uh, I think I can remove you, you, you. You and you. Steel plate, steel plate, steel plate, steel plate. Remake that, because I don't... Oh, actually, it might work for me. That's more than enough. Right, I guess I'll just ask them to get rid of it afterwards. Okay. Yeah, just destroy the chest in there, lad. Yeah. Work their little little robot. Uh, robot myself. Those. That's the tightest I can go. Okie dokie. I don't remember. Do you have two or one uh, portable fusion reactors in yours? Uh, I had two fusion reactors. Mm hmm. <clears throat> um. Uh, how, uh, I don't really, uh, uh, hold on, if I, I shall print screen this and put it on Discord for you. Okay. Because it might make life easier. Might. Mm. Wow, when was the last time I print screened something? Jeez. You don't do that for uh, thumbnails? Uh, no, I use VLC to uh, take a, a screenshot, if you know what I mean. Uh, uh -huh. okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Alright, so... Uh, uh, I need another point of fusion reactor, which means... I think we need another exoskeleton. Need some crescent do, 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 do. Oh, not there. Need some God. Of you. Uh, where did I save that? God damn it. I keep doing it. <laughs> I mean, uh, I click save as. Go to where I think it is and it's not there. And you're like, oh. Oh, okay. That's it. I, I know how that works. Uh... Oh, I still need those. Uh, give me those. There you go. <clears throat> Thank you. Uh, the the gap on the other side was another fusion reactor, and it, basically, basically it's mirrored. You can see, uh, not that anyone can. Well, you, we've just seen that. Yeah. Yeah. The, the gap on the right hand side is a fusion reactor, and then down the bottom I had another rover port and a battery. Yeah. Okay. Because I was greedy with my robot ports. Having 50 robots is really good. Yeah, it also extends the range of the robot ports. Your yes, personal robot ports. It does, it's, uh... right, so. 
Let's open you up. Shields. Bounce circuits and steel plate. Dang it, we're out. Uh, we're out of uh, processing units. We don't have any more of those. I think. Uh, pro what standard ones or? Uh, no, the Bond. the blue ones. Ow! Oh. oh dear. That leads sulfuric acid, doesn't it? Uh, I think so. We have. Yeah, but uh, I have. I have a power armor Mark II. I have three exoskeletons. I have a robo cord, uh, and I have a battery. So you just need a fusion reactor. No, I, I have one portable fusion reactor. Oh, fusion reactor. Okay. So I <laughs> think. I think. So uh, yeah, I think I can make do. Okay, and then you can just add to it. I was going to say we we have some sulfuric acid down here in a record twenty five thousand units of it. So, mm -hmm. but that's about what we do right there for the nuke. Okay. Track. Okay. But I think that's all the sulfuric acid we have. There might be some more down by the uranium pickup. I'm not sure. Mm -hmm. Right, but uh, I'll make do for now. I'll make do for now. Uh, okay. I do need some. Uh, I start the steel processing at the other end and then work on way back. Some... I think that would be better. Logistics, robots, and some construction robots. You get really confused really easily. Do that. There. All right. Uh, okay. So. All right, I'll go hook up the iron up here. Okay, okay. What, what, what is that? Um, I oh, yes, then I've completely forgotten what I'm doing. <laughs> so goes up the outside. Um, I need up the nice transport belts. <coughs> okay. Five hundred of those. I need undergroundies. I need splitters. I need fast inserters. Long handed inserters. Medium electric poles, large electric poles. We'll see if we have any of all that stuff. Someone will bring it for me. Seems we do. There is a new point. Belt. Thank you. Okay. To set up my there, there. there. So, did did you handcraft some? Um... Stack inserters or? Uh, yes. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I, I just just a few. Um, when you put the speed modules into 
the uh, miners. Mm -hmm. uh, and norm normally, turtles just cannot keep up. <laughs> no, uh, the smelters or the miners. Uh, the the miners. I was just I was just literally getting the copper out of the way. Ah, uh, okay. So hopefully with uh, everything being sort of prepared now, we can get back in business and... Uh... That would be great. Let's, I think Things we can. Going. We're running out of power poles, is it? I don't need to be. I don't think we are. You know, worrying about holding on to power poles. Although I won't mirror that. Yeah. Alright, that's two of the iron guys hooked up. Oh, I don't want to put some whites no. in. It's not two of the iron guys hooked up. This is where you tell me I got it all wrong. No, 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 no. Uh, I got it wrong. I got it wrong. Ah, mm. oh, that was me hoping I could destroy it all. It's really fun watching the robots take out a whole area. <laughs> <laughs> It is actually. Uh... Well, you can still come up here. Yep. Really not sure what the hell happened there with those powerballs, but I don't want that. to come up here. Right, that's fine. Now it's four of them hooked up. And then these ones need to come under twice. There. Do it right there. I suppose we could. Like that. Why right. can't the power poles just be one one block more? <laughs> uh, yeah. I don't know what to tell you. I think it's the way the game was designed. 
Well, damn it. Because there was one block more. With, uh, Using small guns. Yeah. Right, we're picking up that. We'll all of you over here next to this one. Strange idea, but I might use the small power pools for that, and I think we've got loads of them, haven't we? Uh, I think we have like, uh, well, everything that was torn up, right? Yeah, so there'll be loads of small power pools. So, yeah, we use we use the small ones for that. He says, hoping they're on their way. Moving away. Do you have power pools? Is it the small or the medium ones? Is it the the wooden ones? The wooden ones, yeah. Oh, okay. It sounds weird, I know, but... It it does. It does sound weird. They don't seem to always want to connect the way you want them to connect. There. What's wrong here? One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Oh. People are going to be screaming at me now, going, really? You're putting the powerful down again? <laughs> and yes, I am putting the powerful down again. Okay. So one of these iron lines has iron plate, the others don't. Uh, uh, yeah, I haven't set the trains working, that was just what was in the trains. Ah, uh, okay. They're, they're all ready set to go, they just haven't been turned on. Okay. Uh, let me... Oh, we need some power up here. Okay, was it done? Done, done, done. That'll do. That'll do. That's all. Everything going. No, 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 no. I don't want to copy land here. All right. I really don't want that one. No one. Oh. Alrighty, so you... I think we might need to put some more stops down here at the iron ore pickup as well. Because one pickup is not going to be enough for three drop offs, is it? Uh, no, quite possibly not. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, those electric poles are going absolutely friggin' nuts in there, so I might have to fix that. 
Where are you? Because the robots aren't putting stuff down in order. You're over there. Yeah, they're they're crisscrossing. Yeah. And I know it's fine, but I don't like it. it, it... No, it looks horrible. Yeah. Oh yeah. Wow. <laughs> Uh, that, that, that's a bit of a, a line mess. We don't actually have enough furnaces for this as well. We don't. We've actually run out of electric furnaces. Dang it. We need to start building stuff. Uh, what, do, what do you need to make electric furnaces? You need... Uh, ironically, steel! Yay. Yeah. Yeah. Stone brick, advanced circuits, and steel. Do we have any advanced circuits in the system? I think we should have. 2,258. A couple. Just just a few, yeah. Steel. Pick up. And stone brick. brick. And there. Right. One of the iron ore trains is going. Go go. Where, where, where is it going? Okay, it's going that way. Ah, oh, of course. I had some weird things with trains. I told them, "Can you just go round and round about and come back again?" It went, "No, I'm going up there." <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see if it makes it there. It did. Is it picking up? It is. make it to me over here without powering up so let's help them out let's meet them halfway right, I am going to request some cliff explosives if I can find them Where are the cliff explosives? Uh, there are some in there. Yeah, uh, so I, I'm looking at the E menu, and oh, uh, they're under. They're not under military. They're under uh, logistics. The very last item. Uh huh. Oh, there they are. All right, we'll request some of you. Not sure what oh. we'll do. We'll do thirty. Yeah, let's do forty. 50 is fine, 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 fine. Uh, I want some... So I'm going to take out all these cliffs down here. Alright, I'll go fix up the um, iron pickup. Okay. So, we've got 13... Uh, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. We're out of time, though. Uh, 166. Oh, we at? Wow. Wow. Okay. Okay. Uh, I can see why I ended up spending you know, hours and hours in this game. <laughs> Yeah, everything anyway. takes time and it's fun. Uh, I, I just lined this train track up, it'd be absolutely fine. Oh look, four hours went by. Oh wow. <laughs> yeah, it, it, it is a, a, a time eater. Or a time stealer. Yes, indeed. But it's a fun one, so that's okay. That 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 is true. That is true. And I am having a lot of fun with this. Um, I don't want to do everything off camera. I know I've done a lot off camera here, but it, it was literally just tearing out a line, a train track, putting it back in again. I finally got it was wrong, tearing it out again, and, and, and I've just done that over and over and over off camera. So that's, uh, yeah. that's, yeah, that's very repetitive work and would be pretty boring. Uh, yeah. I did want to build the steelworks off camera, but obviously we'll, 
we'll do that. But I think, yeah, uh, I'll get that one line of steel going, and then actually look on to producing some things because we're going to run out of them. Yeah, we are. We are. Um, so, particularly yeah. on nuclear, I need to sort of prioritise that because it's currently running on whatever fuel it's got. Oh. And then it runs out, we're dead. <laughs> okay. <laughs> let, let, let's prioritise that then. Uh, yeah, that seems like a good idea, I think. Yeah. Yeah. All right, and I'll uh, fix up this uh, iron pickup so that we have some more trains picking up iron there. And then I'll guess I'll start on the copper so that we can actually start producing stuff again. Yes. Yeah, get the copper plates going. Um, yeah. What once you obviously got the iron one done, if you got it lined up, you can just copy and paste it, can't you? So exactly. So that's perfect. That's perfect. So yeah, I guess we will uh, call it here then, and see you in the next one. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So thank you very much for watching, guys. We hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Have fun.